Just gonna say it, Nintendo, while we're at it. You could bring back all the furry fans that he's getting rid of by making a new Star Fox. Yeah. Take all the Lola Bunny fans that Space Jam 2 ruined. Mm -hmm. You can have them all. It's gonna be great. Sales numbers through the roof. Yeah, Sorry, let me phrase that. Through the woof. God damn it. All right, you gotta double up the funnies now that the other two are gone. See so if you have to increase your funnies. I have to increase my funnies. Hang on, give me a second. I gotta take. I gotta take my copium. I am a this is America, thank you. It's Japan. What's what's the drinking age in Japan? Uh, probably like eighteen. Pig, 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 pig. Quack, 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 quack. Pig. This is the first time I've heard an old song. Oh, we... Twenty, actually. What was that? Uh, drinking age is twenty. Ah, surprised me. I have. Oh, this is the Matan. This is like fucking metal slimes. Okay. Yep, uh, the pigs in the old game, you had to take them out fast. Oh, was it? Was it were the pigs in the old game? I'm pretty sure, that sounds right. Oh. I believe you, I, just, I have zero memory of them. Yeah, I like how they mostly have new songs. I don't like soundtrack as much. I mean, it's still my grow on me, but I do like that they're not really... They, they're doing a cut. There's a couple remixes, but generally, it's a lot of new music. From what little I can hear, it sounds pretty sick. Yeah, it's, it's a different style. It's more, I would say, it's a lot more more, more rock um, than the first soundtrack. I have more, you know, more hip hop -y. Yeah, I said the first one was all hip hop. Right, and secret, um, for everyone who's gotten this far in the video, secret um, drop on Green Knight Gaming. Dro hey. moving, moving to Yu-Gi-Oh. He's gonna. Yeah, maybe. Maybe he's Start gonna he's gonna play the fucking mobile game and get to number one in the in the, in the world and ranked. Jokes on you! You <laughs> think I don't play the mobile game? Isn't it pretty good? Like a pretty good it, client. I, I actually kind of dig it. It's the the. Being for real here, the TCG right now is kind of in a really boring spot. It's Fair. heavy negate. It's heavy negate. Like, turn one is all about setting up three or four negates. So the game is just prevent your from opponent from playing as fast as possible. Hmm. And Duel Links is at least has interaction. Oh, so Duel Links isn't just the meta? Nope. Duel Links, uh, they do... They release different cards in a totally different order. Hmm. So, like, we just got um, some Zexel, which is, like, from 2012. Oh, okay. I thought it was just the, um, like, Pokemon TCG. If you want to learn Yu-Gi-Oh, it's not a bad place to start. It's a really pretty bland. It's for an important character. It's a pretty generic design. This game has some pretty kooky characters, but I like all the side characters. All of the character design's really good. Math Vegeta isn't like I'm trying to figure out what's going on with him because he's not he doesn't inter he's never interacted with anyone besides the main care the main three. He's done any of the cutscenes outside with the main. So well, did you know that he was dead the whole time? Shia LaBeouf, but uh, sir, M Night Shyamalan? they're already dead. It's the Reaper game. Is he, is he extra dead? He's double dead. Double dead. Yeah, I don't know if he's just because they would show him like walking away. So I don't know. He's just he's just that's the thing. He stays in the he stays like in the sidelines, but he's in every battle. So like, just it's kind of weird that they purposely keep him out of every cutscene. Can't let them know that he's hanging out with the uncool crowd. Yeah, it could be that he's trying to hide because even when one of the other um, characters you're committing against mentions your team, he says you only have three. When you have a fourth, so it makes me think either he's not around or. Or what? I don't know. It's really weird. I, ho I hope they do something with it. I hope it's not just took him out of the cutscenes I mean, to save effort. Save on voice act. Yeah. Not, if I that. remember correctly, the first game was pretty good about answering like most of what they were setting up for. Yeah, I feel like I feel like there's gonna be a reason. That's too. It's way too obvious. I do wonder how long this game was in development. Cause it wasn't. It was announced what Jan November, I think. Yeah, let's say it was announced towards like the middle of or late of last year. Yeah, it was pretty late. It must have sold good enough, I guess. If it sold like shit, they wouldn't have made this one. Yeah, I'm not finding sales numbers for the first game, but I did find that apparently there's unused sprites for a rhythm game. Hmm. Love rhythm games. I fucking love the um the Final Fantasy ones on the 3DS. Oh, the theater rhythm? Yeah, those were those were fun as fuck. Hey Nintendo, I know you're listening. Uh, make a new Elite Beat Agents, please. Elite Beat Agents is one of those games, the more I find out about it, the more I'm like, okay, why why has this never been re-released? It is it's I think it's my favorite rhythm game of all time. You gotta help a baseball player win the baseball game by playing the YMCA with him. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> it's so fucking perfect. Take take advantage of the furry market, Nintendo. Um yeah, where's our fucking NBA jam with fucking Lola Bunny? 
Let's go to fanfiction.net. Where's my LeBron X Lola Bunny fanfic at? Alright, give me a minute. Harry Potter, like, if you look up Harry Potter, I mean, maybe not now, it's like five years ago. But, like, you know, you can look up specific crossovers. And, like, the sixth most crossover series with Harry Potter was NCIS. Lola Bunny. Go. God damn it. Oh, hang on. You know what? Let me do something. This is not going on my actual search history. Sir, I'm a writer. I don't care about my search history. My search history is already fucked. You can hear, watch these texts. You see these movements? Look at, look at, look at this camera. Oh, I didn't bother oh. moving. Really. That's mash buttons. He's going ham. Okay, listen. Now, I don't have exactly what you asked for, but I have close. And I think you're gonna like this. Give me a second to pull up the chapter. I would just like to note, by the way, that at the beginning of this, it has starring the live action talents of he's made a casting script. <laughs> Holy crap, there's 26 chapters. Jesus. Um, Alright, I can't find where they're actually talking to each other, but I need you to understand why I'm so confused by this. There's 26 chapters of the Sp a Sailor Moon Looney Tunes Space Jam. That's fucking, uh, uh, that's fucking gold. Does LeBron not become a Sailor Scout? No, this is, this is old Michael Jordan. Oh, this is... Ooh. This is the OG. I don't want a Michael Jordan Sailor Scout. That's the, I mean, actually, I would, I would I'd be okay with Michael Jordan Sailor Scout. Every time this person ends his chapter, he ends it with stay tuned, T-O-O-N. <laughs> I like that, actually. While Bugs Bunny and the Sailor Guardians were dealing with the present of the Witcher 3 in the Capital Line on like... the famed Moron Mountain spaceship, Babs and Buster Bunny were hanging out on the Warner Brothers boardwalk, basking in the sights of the Looney Tune lands. That's not a real sentence, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's goddamn. That's you could only bad. wish that this wasn't. <laughs> well, is Bugs okay? What about the Guardians? Are the Sailor Scouts alright? Babs asked. <laughs> well, from what I was told by Usagi, the girls and Bugs are fine. Bugs is trying to negotiate with the Witches Five about a challenge that will determine not only the fate of the Looney Tunes, but also the Sailor Guardians and all of Warner Brothers as a whole. Luna said. People are ever bored, just fucking boot up fanfiction, find some crossovers. Shout out to my boy Kids WB Youngs. <laughs> yeah, shout out, shout out, shout out to our boy. Oh my gosh! Does it get better? Do you, do you have a new read? Are you gonna favorite this for later? No, I'm looking through- I, so I decided <laughs> to look up Kids WB Youngs as other fanfictions. Oh yeah? Just out of curiosity. Um... <laughs> so, I might have been being generous with my statement of there is only 26 chapters of Looney Tunes meets Sailor Moon. Oh, uh, does he have sequels? <laughs> he has three of them! <laughs> Space hey. Jam, Sailor... Sa Sailor Space Jam, Rise of the Sailors. <laughs> Which so, I can only hope that Popeye's in that one. Why is it specifically Space Jam crying, not just Looney Tunes? <laughs> yeah, I don't is know. Michael Jordan even in it? According to the live-action casting in Chapter 1, yes. Sailor Space Jam, the superhero girl on the Toon Squad. Let me be clear, my laughter is just jealousy. Looney Tunes and the Sailor Scouts, Total Warner Island, a Total Trauma Island crossover. <laughs> it only gets better. And please tell me Michael Jordan's on the island too. Yeah, I, just, I need Michael Jordan in that one. Space Jam, Looney Tunes, and Winx Club turning up the magic. <laughs> God, this uh, this man loves Space Jam, huh? I remember hearing a YouTuber I like one time read a fan fiction for Harry Potter, and my favorite part is it introduced Dobby's cousin, who they decided to give the George Lopez voice for no reason. <laughs> Who's the, who's kids the, WB Youngster. Kids WB Youngster. Friend of, friend of the channel. If you want to be on an episode, we can play some fucking Space Jam the PS1 together. You're gonna get a call. Hey man, I need you to take that down. Nobody can find out about my fan fiction. <laughs> For yeah. those of you who aren't educated in Japanese, Danganronpa means bullet trial. Oh, does it? I actually don't know that. Uh, I'm going to cheat for Digimon. Sir. So, in sleep mode, uh, some games, the in-game clock still run. Um... 
Specifically, Bandai Namco, for whatever reason, has a really hard time with this. And the Digimon version of the daycare uh, doesn't care about what you walk, it cares about real in-game time. Mmm, so you can just sleep mode and gain yep. fucking 24 hours of levels? Yep, yep. That sounds really broken. I'm gonna make sure- future editing, Cody, make sure you get the scene in of this dirty rotten cheater. But she loved me anyways, because I'm adorable. Yeah, also subscribe to the to Green Knight Gaming. Tell them to play fucking uh, Bakugan channel. I just remember they'd be like, we have a special surprise from way forward. And everyone's like, Shantae's getting a new game? And they're like, Bakugan. And they're like, why is this here? It looks bad. Uh, did you have Boomerang growing up? Um, A little bit. I don't think the whole time. I think, I think we kind of fluctuated on off the cable. For this show called The Banana Splits. And yes. it had a re Yes. Uh, there's a splits. horror movie for them. Oh. But, where they are animatronics who but, kill people. But but why? Because Five Nights at Freddy's. But but why? <laughs> like, is it an official Banana Splits movie? It's an official Banana Splits movie from Warner Brothers. Oh, shit. Okay. So they were just trying to carry the fucking... Take advantage of the Five Nights at Freddy's craze. The movie is Nicolas Cage beating up the Five Nights at Freddy's animatronics for an hour and a half. <laughs> And I it's... wish I could tell you that I was exaggerating. <laughs> I really want whoever plays Naruto to be some sort of really over-the-top hammy actor. So that way when we get the Shadow Clones, it's just that much worse. <laughs> like, I want, like, Nicolas Cage to play him. <laughs> and we just get him Shadow Cloning and they're just all screaming. Hey, WB, hit us up. We can do more casting. Let's get Nicolas Cage to play 14-year-old Naruto Uzumaki. Yeah, I'm surprised that I honestly didn't talk about um, One Piece, like, very little in uh, World Seeker. I think I was too busy bitching about fucking... I was too, too busy complaining about One Piece to talk about One was. Piece. Yeah, and if we talked about, like, in the chapters or any, a whole lot of things... But granted, I also talked about a shit ton of things in um, Fire yeah. Warriors 4. Yeah. Which... Come on, Namco, when are we getting a new One Piece game? Anything. Obviously, Demon Slayer with a roster of eight. Let's yeah. go down. Add more in DLC. Uh, I'm surprised they didn't put more effort in Demon. They got fucking Cyber Connect too, like on that game, and they've had a while. That game's been in production for a long ass time. It was announced like over two years ago. Let's go, Food Wars Fighters. Let's go, Food Wars Fighters. It. Uh, if it's another Fighters game, if it's e it's either Fighter, it's either Dragon Ball Two or it's gonna be My Hero. I think the best solution. Would be um, just a um, a jump force fighters. That's what I was thinking. I was like, you just do a uh, jump. I was to say, just do a shonen jump fighters. That that would be ideal. I think that would make most people happy because everybody wants a Naruto, a My Hero, and a One Piece fighter, and that's not gonna happen. But make it good. Yeah, make it. Bo Bo, I'll be happy. Do what? As long as I can be Bo Bo, Bo I'll be happy. Bo Bo, Bo wasn't in Jump Force, was he? No, he was in the. Uh, Jump Stars Plus, yeah. but he wasn't in Jump Force. He was in Victory Versus, and he was in the, the DS ones. All three of them? All three of them. I'm sorry, so, that's pretty generous. All one of them. You have 18 subscribers, sir. I have not missed a video. Uh, but if you're going to if you're going to bed, thanks for the free content. I'll send you a you're check. You're welcome, man. I'll, thanks for some chit-chat. I'll send you 5% of whatever I make off this video. Okay, I'll be waiting for that zero. Okay. Alright, night, buddy. I'll talk to you tomorrow.